Welcome to Nerdio's WBD demo of the day video series. This video is all about publishing app attach applications using the Nerdio manager for WBD application. It is functionality that has become available in the Nerdio manager starting with version 2.4 of the application. And there are three steps involved in setting up an app attach environment allowing users to leverage app attach applications. So this will be one of several videos in this series. So the first step in starting to use app attach applications is defining an app attach storage location that will be the place that you'll be able to upload your app attach applications to and then be able to reference those applications and mount them inside of users WVD sessions. So let's start with that. We're gonna click on settings in the Nerdio Manager and go to integrations. Here we will see a new tile called App Attach Storage Locations with a button to link a new location. Now a prerequisite for this is to use Azure Files and this Azure Files share must be integrated with Active Directory. The reason for this is that the session host VMs and users must be able to mount this VHD or VHDX file that's going to be the app attach application inside of their WVD session. And in order to do so, it must support um, NTFS AD integrated permissions. So if you already have an Azure files with AD integration deployed in your environment, then you are pretty much done. You can link this location, which we'll do in a minute. If you do not, um, you'll recall in the previous video, we review the process of linking or creating new Azure file shares and joining them to your domain. And you can see here in my demo environment, I have two file shares. One of them is actually joined to the domain and the other one is not. The one that's not joined to the domain has a little exclamation point and a script I can download to run it on my domain controller to join it to the domain. So let's go ahead and click on the link button to add our app attach storage location. Once we click link, we can give this um, location a name. So let's call it app attach North Central US, which is where uh, this particular Azure file share resides. And you can see that I have my two Azure file shares listed. One of them is disabled, one of them is enabled. The disabled one is the one that's not joined to AD and the one that's enabled is joined. So I will go ahead and select it and click OK. Once I click OK, you will see that it has now been added. And as the next step, I will be able to upload my app attach applications into this Azure file location, which is going to be the topic of our next video. See you soon.